Inside that the cabin feels like a high-tech sanctuary, bright, airy, with panoramic windows and comfortable, sustainable seats. Clever storage replaces bulky overhead bins, and the lighting adapts to the mood of the flight. The cockpit is a marvel. Large touchscreens replace the maze of dials and switches, giving pilots a clean, intuitive interface. Advanced software manages power and enhances safety, automatically stabilizing the plane in tough conditions. But the biggest difference is the silence. Even before takeoff, the cabin is remarkably quiet. You can speak in a normal voice and the windows block out wind noise. This quietness transforms the experience. No more noisy vibrating tube, but a peaceful observation deck in the sky. Every detail from design to technology is focused on comfort and calm. It's a new standard for what flying can feel like. The electric jet isn't just about efficiency, it's about redefining the passenger experience. Step inside and you'll never look at air travel the same way again. Let's get ready for takeoff. As we prepared for takeoff, I braced for the usual roar and vibration, but it never came. The pilot communicated with air traffic control and with a gentle hum, we started to move. Acceleration was smooth and quick, more like a high-speed train than a jet. The sound, just a rising whoosh like a gust of wind. The cabin stayed calm. I could talk to my neighbor without raising my voice. Imagine planes taking off without waking up entire neighborhoods. This jet makes that possible. The electric motors delivered power instantly and smoothly with no surges or lurches. Liftoff was elegant, almost effortless, as if the plane was being lifted by an invisible hand. The climb was serene, no shuddering, just a smooth ascent into the sky. I found myself smiling in awe of the experience. The quietness was astonishing. I could hear the landing gear retract, a sound usually drowned out by engines. This takeoff redefined what it means to fly, graceful, quiet and peaceful. The future of flight is here and it's whisper quiet. At cruising altitude, the flight felt magical. The motors faded into a background whisper and the absence of vibration was profound. A glass of water on my tray stayed perfectly still, no ripples, just smoothness. Electric motors have few moving parts, so there's far less vibration than in a traditional jet. Even in light turbulence, the advanced control system made tiny adjustments, keeping the ride stable. The large windows and quiet cabin created a stunning, immersive view. With no engine roar, I could truly appreciate the beauty outside. Conversations were easy, music sounded clear, or you could simply enjoy the silence. This comfort and quiet could make air travel more pleasant and productive for everyone. Imagine working or relaxing as if you were in your office or living room. Cruising on this electric jet felt less like transportation and more like a peaceful escape above the clouds. It's a new way to experience flight. So how does this jet fly so quietly and smoothly? The secret is distributed electric propulsion, or DP. Instead of two big engines, there are many small electric motors spread along the wings. Smaller fans mean less noise, and each motor drives a fan to create thrust. A smart computer system controls each motor with precision, optimizing lift and efficiency. This setup allows for shorter takeoffs, greater safety, and instant compensation if a motor fails. Multiple motors are more efficient across all phases of flight, saving energy crucial when running on batteries. The design also enables new aerodynamic aircraft shapes. Electric motors are simple, reliable and require less maintenance. Instant torque gives the jet its smooth, rapid acceleration. By combining quiet electric power with smart control, engineers have created a true leap forward in aviation. This is the future of flight built on innovation. The electric motors are only half the story. The real challenge is the battery. The jet's battery pack is massive, custom designed, and must be both powerful and lightweight. Engineers strive for maximum energy in minimum weight, what they call energy density. The batteries use thousands of lithium ion cells managed by a smart battery management system or BMS. The BMS monitors every cell for safety, preventing overheating and ensuring smooth power delivery. The battery pack is encased in a fireproof shell for extra protection, but batteries are heavy and even the best ones can't match the energy of jet fuel. That's why today's electric jets have limited range, perfect for short hops between nearby cities. 
Battery technology is improving rapidly, with new chemistries promising lighter, more powerful cells. As batteries get better, electric jets will fly farther and serve more routes. The journey is just beginning, but progress is fast. The future of electric aviation depends on these battery breakthroughs. Every flight brings us closer to longer, cleaner journeys. Landing was as serene as takeoff. No engine pitch changes, no loud air brakes. The pilot precisely controlled our descent with the electric motors. Some electric jets even use regenerative braking, turning air resistance into a bit of extra battery charge. The approach was stable, with the flight control system making constant, tiny adjustments. The quiet cabin let us hear the gentle chirp of the tyres touching down, a sound usually lost in engine noise. Braking was smooth, combining regenerative and traditional brakes. We taxied in near silence, causing no disturbance to ground crews. Shutting down, there was no engine scream, just instant quiet. The landing reinforced the jet's character, smooth, quiet, precise, stepping off, the air was clean, no jet fuel smell, just a sense of a cleaner future. As amazing as electric jets are, range is their biggest limitation. My flight was under 200 miles, typical for today's electric aircraft, designed for short-haul trips and air taxis. Long-haul flights aren't possible yet, but that will change as batteries improve. Charging is another challenge. After landing, the jet connected to a high-powered DC fast charger. Even with powerful chargers, recharging takes 30 minutes to over an hour, much longer than refueling with jet fuel. Faster charging and upgraded airport infrastructure are essential for widespread adoption. Airports will need new substations, cables and charging terminals to support fleets of electric planes. Building this ecosystem is a huge task requiring cooperation between governments, airports and energy companies. The future of electric flight depends as much on ground infrastructure as on the planes themselves. We're at the start of this transformation. The groundwork for a new era in aviation is being laid right now. My first electric jet flight was more than a cool experience. It was a glimpse into aviation's future. These jets aren't just novelties. They're a fundamental shift towards sustainable air travel. By eliminating carbon emissions and noise, they offer real solutions for our planet and our cities. Airports could move closer to city centers, making travel more convenient and accessible. Thousands of regional airports could be revitalized, connecting more communities. Imagine quiet air taxis whisking you across town or to nearby cities, all with minimal impact. Of course, challenges remain, better batteries, global charging networks and new regulations. But aviation's history is full of overcoming the impossible. The brightest minds are working on these problems and progress is rapid. Stepping off that quiet jet, I felt real optimism. This is the start of a revolution. Electric jets will grow from short range to larger aircraft, eventually transforming global travel. The sky of the future will be cleaner, quieter and smarter. And it all begins with the elegant hum of an electric motor lifting us toward a better tomorrow. The electric jet is here and it's ready to change the world.